Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about differentiation of trigonometric functions, and we're going to differentiate each function with respect to x. So, if I was given this function, f of x is equal to sine to the third power of x to the fifth power. Now, one thing to note here, and it's always good to, to see this, and it takes a while maybe to see that, that third power right there is really saying this. We have sine of x to the fifth. All of that is going to the third power, the whole thing. And this does help us find that derivative. So f prime of x here, taking that derivative, we're going to apply basically the chain rule twice. Okay. So the chain rule, we have keep the inside the same, take a derivative from the outside. The power rule comes out, so we have 3 of, keep the inside the same, sine of x to the fifth to the second power, all right, using the power rule there. Now we derive, uh, take a derivative of the inside, so we almost ignore these other parts right there, ignore them, and think about that inside, sine of x to the fifth. Well, derivative of sine is cosine, so we have cosine here of keep the inside the same, x to the fifth, times now the chain rule again, because the derivative of the inside has the second chain rule applied to it, and the derivative of the inside, x to the fifth, uh, power is 5x to the 4th. And so at this point, we have taken the derivative, but we can, of course, simplify and make this look a little nicer here. So I'm going to put the 5x five, um, x, uh, five x up front. So we have 5 times 3 is 15, and we have x to the 4th. Times now, I'm not going to write it like this. Let's write it nice and neat there. Sine, instead of the second power, sine squared of x to the 5th. Times what's left here, that cosine of x to the fifth, and there we have it. Our final answer here, 15x to the fourth times sine squared of x to the fifth times cosine of x to the fifth power. So let's recap. We're given that f of x is equal to sine to the third power of x to the fifth. Well, what we know is that that, uh, that third power can be shown like this on the outside. That really helps us see the chain rule in, uh, in progress here, or uh, the process of it. So the three comes down up front, and I'll use power rule there. Uh, two, 3 gets minus by 1 is 2, and keep the inside the same, sine of x to the power. Then we take the derivative of the inside. Derivative of sine is cosine, so if cosine of, keep the inside of the sine the same, which is x to the fifth, times the derivative of x to the fifth, which is 5x to the fourth power. Rearrange that, plot 5x to the fourth out front, multiply by 3 to get 15x to the fourth, and then this power here, that all second power, it really should be written like this proper notation there. So our final answer is 15x to the fourth times sine squared of x to the fifth times cosine of x to the fifth. 